am really honored to accept the highly prestigious Fukuoka Grand Prize. I'm awed by the list of past winners and proud to join that distinguished cohort. I am happy to accept this award and dedicate it to fellow journalists fighting immense odds to report on and help millions of the rural marginalized, devastated by the pandemic, whose stories need to be told. Particularly, I dedicate this to my colleagues at the People's Archive of Rural India, who continue to report from the ground on the migrants, the workers, the farmers, the landless, the artists and the artisans, the fisher folk and the destitute. In a world witnessing the retreat of the rural everywhere, they give me hope. I am delighted to accept this award because it signals support for an endangered species in journalism. At a time when the public needs journalism more than they ever have, corporate owned media have laid off thousands of journalists and media workers, as always, prizing profits above people. Hyper commercialization of media means there are now two schools of journalism, essentially. One is journalism, the other is stenography. The Fukuoka Grand Prize given to someone like me reassures me that there are institutions of strong progressive internationalist ideals and spirit who do not want journalists to be mere stenographers to power. My sincere thanks to the people and city of Fukuoka for this great honor.